Harry OG. Hey, long time What's no up, see. What's up, man? Hey. What's up? Midnight's just around the corner. So I've just been watching movies for 24 hours. At midnight, I will change from this form into something unrecognizable. So, have you reached a decision? Yes. Okay. I'll be waiting in his room until midnight. Come see me when you have your answer. Oh. Um. Ryoji kun. Oh, and one more thing. Don't let the fact that you'll have to kill me influence your decision. As I said before, I'm going to disappear anyways. I won't feel any pain by dying. You know, because I'm since I'm literally death itself, I literally won't feel anything. So there's no need to worry about me. Oh, we weren't worried about that. We're worried about like our own feelings. I'll be waiting. Bye, Ryoji. Have you made your decision? Uh, yeah. Yes. I see. Have the rest of you made your decision? No need to ask me. You know how I feel. I wouldn't be here if I wasn't on board. I'm with the rest of you. I'm in too. The dog? I have made my decision as well. The dog? Can we see the dog? Dog? Then we're all in agreement, yes? Better let him know then. We're all gonna kill him. Oh wait, uh, let me check the script. Um, oh, we're we're not gonna kill. Okay. Him. All right, yeah. Okay, let's go. Let's kill him, or not kill him. I'm just gonna... Hey. It's been a long time since we talked like this in your room. Although back then, I didn't appear in this form and wasn't known by this name. Don't tell me you've all decided to let me live. You're all going to risk your lives on a battle you can't win. But you're the only one here right now, so... I'll say this one more time. If you kill me, Tartarus, the Dark Hour, and your memories of the battles will all disappear. Tomorrow, you'll wake up a normal high school student. You'll be able to live in peace until the moment of the fall. But if you let me live, you'll spend every waking moment until that day in fear of your inevitable death. Nyx cannot be defeated. It's useless to fight her. Are you still thinking? Or have you already made up your mind? I guess my words didn't change your mind.
There's still some time until midnight. I didn't want to have to show you this, but I have no choice. See? I'm not human. I will bring death to this world until I am finally satiated. Do not hesitate to kill me. I want you to think about this carefully. Is facing Nyx really the best decision? Right now, you are all confused by the truth. But some things in this world cannot be changed. You do not understand this yet. Memories are ambiguous. Old ones can be replaced with new ones, creating a new reality. Don't you want to end all your friends' pain and suffering? It's up to you. You're the only one who can make this decision. Now, this is your last chance. Tell me your answer. understand it's regrettable but it's your life you can do what you want with it I will respect your decision let's go back to the lounge I need to tell you guys how to confront Nyx. Yo, what's up, Ryoji? It's an unfortunate decision, but... It That's right. But you can't defeat Nyx. It's impossible. But we must still try. Personally, I don't care if it is impossible. I understand. It's almost midnight, so I'll keep this brief. I'll tell you where to find Nyx. She'll be at Tartarus. You must reach the top of the tower before the promised day. When's the promised day? Exactly one month from tomorrow. January 31st, 2010. Nyx will descend to Tartarus. And the world will end. If you go to the top of Tartarus on that day, you'll be able to face her. The tower exists for the purpose of Nyx's coming. As the appraiser, I usher Nyx into this world. Tartarus welcomes her arrival. The 
tower exists for the purpose of Nix's coming. That's why it's called the tower. So if we reach the top, we can fight Nix? Yes, but remember. From today, you will fight. Like I've said so many times before, Nyx cannot... When you face her, you will finally understand this truth. And then you will realize what it is you are trying to stand against. We understand. There's no need to... January. Well, I'll be going on ahead of you then. I want to leave you while I'm still in this form. Ryoji-kun. Forget that you were my e I guess. Thank you. This will probably be the last time I'll see you all like this. be watching over you. Well, goodbye. Best wishes in the coming year. what you say on New Year's Eve, right? See ya! <laughs> that Ryoji. Happy New Year, Senpai! Um... Thanks. Happy New Year! Let's make this the best year ever! You mean the best month? It's New Year's, but there's nothing really special to do. Oh, God. Well, you can always wish people a New Year's greeting. And also wait for the fireworks to happen, but that's last like, night, right? have a great year! Yeah. I want to do something more. Happy.
Happy New Year to you too, Coro. You two have just been inseparable. Oh man, I completely overslept. Why did I stay up all night watching that stupid movie? Did you guys see it? It had these giant Amazon women running around in the jungle. Why would I watch that? Um, is anyone going to visit the shrine? No, I don't believe in superstitions. Me either. Oh, that's too bad. Yukari-san and the others are already there. They're all wearing kimonos. Kimonos, huh? Uh, I'm gonna run to the store. Hold it right there, Hold Junpei. Right there, Junpei. <laughs> you were saying Happy uh, New what? Year. You're going to the shrine, aren't you? Oh. N no, I'm not. I'm, uh, I'm just going for a walk. You sure you're not? Because you could just be going to the stairs to go back to sleep. Oh, yeah? Well, I'm going with you then. Oh, I'll go too. All right, then, let's go. You coming? Anyone know where it is? Yeah, the girl told me the directions. Sweet! to leave Yucatan <laughs> What <laughs> Happy New Year Hmm What's the matter Yori It's you senpai you look hot. I, um, <laughs> I mean... Stop staring at me. Never worn a kimono before. Does my sash look okay? Fuka, you look. Jeez. This traditional clothing is quite interesting. However, it's difficult to move in. I'm so glad I came. 
Junpei-san, why are you acting so strange? Man, we got to see some great stuff today. Right, Akihiko-senpai? love this time of year. Um, that's not what I meant. Junpei-san said that you guys aren't wearing anything underneath your kimonos. He said what? What happened? He's just gonna like say it in the court of law. <laughs> I didn't say it. I'll stay a little bit. What did you wish for, Fuka? I... I wished for a great year. It's a bit generic, but that's what I really want. That's what I want as well. How <laughs> funny. We all wished for the same thing. a plea for help. I know that we'll be victorious.
Okay, so I'm gonna take a break from this again. And I'm just gonna... First place we start over. 